Welcome to the Hillsborian Historian. My name is Rex, and today we focus on the class of 1983. This yearbook is dedicated to Mr. Scora, who led both sound system and concert chorus. Here are some scenes from Spirit Week, and here you can actually see the spirit. These students are dressed up for 21st Century Day. They got it pretty close. As always, there was a ton of school spirit at the Big Red. There is some Terrier trivia. 100 years earlier in October 1882, the first official HHS classes were held. This student is sitting on one of the legendary coffins. This is some of that cool 80s music that people listen to on those fancy record players. Mission Bell Square was very popular at this time. The Beaker Breakers participated in a program with Chuck E. Cheese at this time to raise money for a new computer. Chuck E. was kind of scary looking back in these days. Video arcades were still popular with games like Zaxxon and Tron. By today's standards, these games may not seem very exciting, but back in the day, they were a really big deal. The Terrier Creed continues to evolve. It now tells us to refrain from profane language. This replaces the concept of smoking in designated areas, as by now there are no designated areas to smoke at in HHS. there would be a change of a venue for graduation. Principal Collins would be handing out diplomas at the Florida State Fairgrounds. Some seniors did not like this as they thought they would be graduating in a cow pasture, but they weren't. 
They may have been graduating near or next to a cow pasture, however. No matter what, the future was bright for the class of 1983. Thanks for joining me as I chronicle the history of HHS. In full disclosure, this was my junior year at the school, and here is a picture of a young Hillsborian historian. Perhaps some things are best left unchronicled. Please subscribe to my channel to keep up with all of my HHS videos, and as always, Go Big Red.